Hi, Miss Mortimer here, and today we're going to look at our high Ds and high C sharps. But first of all, let's just do a quick warm up. Let's do our low register C, D, E, F, open G. Here we go. Lots and lots of air, nice clarinet sound. <laughs> in the high register but we'll stop when we get to C so G A B C hold that C on here we go three four let's do that one more time remember lots and lots of air and keeping a nice E shape here but keep everything else relaxed e -e -e. Here we go, hi G. Okay, well done. Now for our high D fingers. Our high D fingers are like our high F, so with the speaker key on the back, but without the top finger. So find your high F, one, two, three, and one, speaker key, and then take off your first finger. We're gonna do a run up, we're gonna play low B flat, high F, add on the speaker key, then high D, take off your top finger. So it'll sound like this. Okay, let's have a go at that, B flat, Add on the speaker key to make F and high D, take off the top finger. Great, let's try that one more time. Done, and you might need to practice that a few more times just pause the video and have another go the next one we're going to try and do is go from our high C which is just your thumb and the speaker key to our high D but we're going to do it in two steps we're going to go C down to F and then lift off the first finger to get our D here we go let's have a go again pause the video and have a few tries of that okay now we're going to try and go straight from C to D so let's practice the fingers C is just your thumb and the speaker key D we've got nothing on the first finger and then one two three back to a C and to a D we're trying to get the fingers really smooth because if we don't interrupt the airstream it's much easier to make our high D work. Okay, here we go from C to D. Three, four. Okay, great. And you might just want to practice those three steps for today. So first of all, B flat, F, D, then C, F, D, and then C, straight to D. And then we can practice that in a little scale. We can go G, A, B, C, high D. Here we go. And when you're really happy with those fingers, to make our high D more in tune, he needs to be a little bit higher. We're gonna put on this key down here. So that is your E flat key, you'll know it as. And for a D, we add it on with the little finger. So now we've got no top finger. One, two, three. 
and the little finger and it just makes it a bit more in tune so remember that if you can okay so there's your high D next one to have a look at is high C sharp so this is in between our high C and the high D and your high C sharp is these fingers here so it's like your low A or your high E and then take off the first finger so we're going to do the same thing that we did for high D let's play low A high E add on the speaker key and then take off the top finger to make high C sharp here we go you might find that one comes out a little bit easier than your high D, in which case start there and add high D later. Let's do that again. Great, and now let's go B, E, C sharp. Pause the video and practice any of these by yourself. Now we're going to go B, straight to C sharp. So we're taking off the first finger and putting down the next two and two. B to C sharp. Here we go. And now my favourite tune to practice high D and high C sharp is We Will Rock You. Very simple, we go D, C sharp, B, A, B, B. So it's just four notes. Just practice the fingers along with me. D, C sharp, B, A, B, B. And it'll sound like this. Lots of air on your high D. practice that a few times over remember keep everything relaxed nice e shape here and lots of air through the clarinet <laughs> 